Good morning, Nora. Kids are after uh, going to school. Yeah. Yeah. I eat yogurt. You ate a yogurt. Yeah. Is it in your belly? <laughs> Hello, Olivia. Hi, baby. I'm going to adventure. She's going on an adventure. Yeah. Where's her adventure going to be? Outside. Do you think she'll crawl outside? Yeah. You're really moving around. Yeah, I like it. She oh, doesn't. We are not playing. You like moving around? Yes. <laughs> She's coming. Whoop! She rolled over. I did it again. She did it again. <laughs> Very cute. Can I do twist? What are we going to do today? Daddy's got to put all this washing away. Mummy folded so well. And What's in here? Oh, is there some folded in there? Okay, I've got to put that away too. They're your clothes. Should you put them away? No. You can't put them away? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Well, will you play with Olivia so I can put the clothes away? Yeah. Okay, cool. Me awesome. Too. Me too. You too. Okay, cool. So I'm at Ikea. I forgot my camera, so I'm going to do this on my phone. Um, but I'm here to get... I have to get a new peeler because the kids use it and then stick in the dishwasher, turn the dishwasher on, then I go to cook dinner, don't have a peeler, then got to peel everything with a knife. So... I've decided to just go and buy the four dollar peeler to um, save my life um, and I broke our spaghetti a pasta strainer thing last night so I need to get a new one of those but I don't think they have one here that I like um, I'm pretty sure I've looked at it before and I want to find something to store the girls hair stuff in like it's driving me crazy to have scrunchies and bows and clips and stuff all over the bathroom sink and all over Olivia's change table in our room so I want to try and find something for that. Couldn't find anything online, but I find that you find a lot more stuff in the actual shop at IKEA. Anyway, so I'm going to go and hunt down those things, and yes. Okay, so I've just gone to Aldi and done a big Aldi shop. Um, a lot of the stuff we buy from Aldi is like junky stuff, I find. So most of it isn't healthy-ish. But um, anyway, here we go. So I've got six milks at the back because that's literally all they had. I need 14, so I'll have to go somewhere else and get more. I've got dried apricots, um, the fruit in a cup thing. I've got three of them. Uh, two packets of the blueberry muffin bars because they only had two that weren't, like, opened. Um, three of the apple ones. Some um, shells, uh, some pasta. There's three of them. Two cucumbers. Then we got a bunch of these um, custard cream cookies and chocolate cream cookies. These cookies got cocoa, um, rice, um, breakfast bubbles, fruity rings, three different types of tiny teddies, two packets of um, yogurt. Then we got two blocks of cheese, three spaghetti sauces, three tuna bake pasta um, sauces. Then we have crackers, they eat them like they're going out of fashion. Um, then we have these chicken, I love these chicken for all sorts of things. These are on sale um, for eight dollars for 24. Um, Woolies are 11, so I got the last four packets that they had of them. These are on sale as well, and we eat these, um, the kids love these um, to make palmers. So I got two rounds of them, we need four packets around we've um, got some sausage rolls and some party pies some ham some chicken tenders sweet chocolate tenders some nuggets butter um, a margarine really and then two things of butter onion rings dim sims um, and then we've got fresh beans here and then I got Olivia some of these clothes so a zero in these um, purple like organic cotton things these are lined 
um, jeans. I really like them for winter. And then I got a um, size one of these as well because I reckon she'll be in zero and one over winter. Then I got her this jacket to go into school pickup. These are only $15. I literally just wanted something to put over her clothes to if it's raining. Um, yeah, so she doesn't get soaking wet. Then we got a big thing of vegetable oil and some pull-ups. So I didn't film in IKEA because I realized I didn't charge my phone overnight. I'm going well today. Um, so I'll show you what I got there. So I got three of these to do freezing meals. So this will only make one meal for us. I might get another um, in a few weeks. So the, the lids are sold separately, I believe. But anyway, I got these um, three. And I got these to try with all the hair stuff. I know that the... What are they called? The hair band things, headband things aren't going to fit in there, but I'll have to find something else for them. I got these because Costco haven't had the gallon bags in ages, so I just got these ones. Um, and then I got batteries because we needed batteries and it seemed like a great idea to get them there. Um, I found a spaghetti or pasta spoon, but it came with friends. Um, so we actually needed another one of these as well, but we didn't really need these. That will work. And I got my peeler. That is like the best peeler. I got some new oven mitts. I usually get the $1.99 ones that are a lot longer, but they go halfway up my arm and it's really frustrating. So these ones are shorter. It's still way too big for my hands, but hopefully they're better. And, you know, we need a second set so it's easier to wash them. Um, and then I've got this to cut up apples in the morning. A lot of the kids like their apples cut. Um, I believe it was only 3 or $4. Then they had these with their new stuff. These are um, recycled plastic, apparently. Um, so I got them. They're 2 for $9 each. The kids like ones with a handle. I don't know why, but they like it. And the ones I brought from the op shop are falling apart already. So they sort of need to go in the bin. I also got a giant blue bag that came free with my membership, I believe, for Beth Head, or it was a dollar, I don't know, whatever. Um, so yeah, I got all that, and I just need to put it all away, and all the cereal and stuff, all the meat and stuff, it's already gone back in the freezer. No, no, should we put Olivia in the tutu train? In the back? I would have put her in the front, but... Alright, we'll put her in the front then. Because then it won't go boom. Gonna... Are you going to push her? She can't push her. I struggle with this thing. Go hit the whip it. It's in the wall. Oh, gosh. Oh, did you hit the wicket? Are you going to choo-choo train her? Please don't flip it. <laughs> Go, no, no. Olivia likes it. Olivia. Ah, hang on, there's a spider. No. I think I'll pull. Ready? Olivia! Olivia, hi! Olivia, it's the kid that's the cat. Oh, oh no. Hang on. Right, we got out of the pickle. Let's go! Wait, do we ignore her? Is that in the way? I'm a crossing man! Let's go! Joel, Joel and Zoe have gotten really heavy. Let go of her arm, you're scaring her. She's got to work. She's holding on like, no, I'm going to fall, I'm going to fall, I'm going to fall, I'm going to fall, I'm going to fall. Dinner time. Yes, Joel, do you have a question? Do you have a question? You have a question? 
Oh. I'm just zooming in on your dinner, mummy. Just waiting for the corn. Hmm. You're gonna eat dinner? Is it yummy? How about you use your knife and fork? That's good. That's better. Yes. I don't know. Why you got sauce from Andrew? Ah. So it's the end of another day. I went to where did I go to first? I went to IKEA first, even though I did the hauls the other way around because we had meat and stuff. Um, so I went to IKEA first. Forgot the camera, um, and we have two of them. So I could have. We, I usually have one in my handbag, and one stays in the house. So I don't know. It wasn't in my handbag. My phone I forgot to put on charge or. Sometimes I sit it next to the cable. It doesn't help because you've got to plug it in for it to actually charge. But anyway, that's another day story. Um, so I went there. I just went down to the market hall because I didn't need anything big. I knew what I was getting. So I know a lot of you just wanted to walk through with the shop with me. But I just don't feel comfortable at this stage going there. There's been two times... Um, our IKEA has actually been shut down for cleaning for COVID so I just go and get what I want and leave pretty much with all shops now I don't generally dawdle, dawdle around um, but I probably will start I've got to go do my Easter shopping and that sort of thing but um, anyway then I went to Aldi and it was probably the world's worst Aldi that I decided to go to I used to go there and then I stopped going and I couldn't remember the reason why I stopped going now I remember um, they had like no chicken the meat they pretty much they had four packets of sausages and a few other packets of things nearly all the boxes like the big biscuit basket whatever the biscuit boxes and like the muesli bar boxes were all open and that and the yogurt like you know the yogurts that have like the ones I brought in the cardboard packaging all of them were open some of them were even snapped and it was just weird like even the boxes in the freezers were all open like I had to really like dig through them to get a pack of nuggets that were closed um, but anyway apart from that I got a few things I don't go to Aldi very often probably only every other month maybe every month I haven't been there in a long time we have like zero Aldi food in our um, cupboard. So it might have actually been before Christmas that I last went there. Anywho, um, so I very rarely go there. I pretty much, I don't go there often because I find that all I get there is junky food and that sort of thing. But today they had the sausages. I don't usually buy their sausages because I find them really fatty, but I brought them. Um, but I won't eat them. We only eat sausages probably every other week Even though Harry really likes them um, But yeah, so They're not a like every time food. So I just let it go um, And I have other ones from Woolies in there. So maybe I'll alternate Alternate them. It's been a long day. Okay. I'm struggling with my talking um, But yeah, I'll work it out and then I got the tenders, which I've never brought from there before, and I'm really fussy with the tenders. I really like the Ingham ones, but I'll try them and see what I think. And the nuggets, I'm fairly certain the kids prefer the Ingham nuggets over the Aldi ones, but we'll see. But the boxes all look different, and I was confused, so I just got what I want. I missed a whole bunch of stuff in the hall, too. There was a whole bag there that wasn't unpacked. <laughs> and... I missed the apples and a few other things that I, I was like, hello, go back when I was editing it because I always edit the video up until this point um, and make sure the footage is right for one and yeah um, and then tonight uh, a lot of you have asked about Wife Swap, yes we are on Wife Swap, it's already, we've already watched it, we, we cannot film it or anything, I cannot talk about it or anything. Um, it's a part of our contract. It's always a part of a contract if you film anything with any channel or whatever. Um, so, um, first of all, I, I, we had an amazing time with 
filming um, and Channel 7 have been amazing through the time that from filming like the pre-filming filming and after filming um, and so the crew were absolutely amazing with the kids and stuff so um, that is all I'm going to say about that people in the US um, go on Channel 7 catch up you need to turn off your location on your device so the internet doesn't know where you are and then you go on Channel 7 Catch Up and you can watch it on there. Um, the people in the UK or anyone in the world can do that. Um, these are the countries that have asked. Um, UK, it is actually on Channel 4, I've been told. Um, and you can watch it. They are two episodes behind. So we're episode 4. Um, I think you just watched episode 2 this week. Maybe 3. You might have watched it by the time you watch this video. But yeah, that is how you watch it, and that's all I can say from here. But that is that. But we really enjoyed it. So um, I'm going to go end this video because it's after midnight. I still need to produce it, make a thumbnail, and then tidy up a few things that I need to do. I can't actually remember. And I have to finish my task for uni. Oh, God, this is a long night. Um, so I need to go do that. And I need to be up at 6.30 in the morning. But we can do this. Um, but that is all for today, guys. Like, subscribe, and comment below. Bye.